such a big and successful career so like what uh, legacy do you hope to leave behind for like neurosurgery definitely uh, i struggled so hard uh, so much and worked hard so much uh, to develop this endoscopic field for past uh, uh, 11 years definitely when we someday i have to retire right yeah someday i have to retire so always when you look back what legacy you have left behind so my teacher used to always say uh, we need to always uh, leave a positive uh, legacy where the younger generation take this legacy forward when you look back uh, what have you left behind and there is nothing to talk about then definitely it is bad you were so selfish so definitely i don't want to be like that so we i have trained almost uh, more than 200 to 300 uh, surgeons till now in endoscopic spine surgery for past uh, uh, 10 years so why i train them uh, at least uh, a few of them uh, take this endoscopy very seriously and take this endoscopy forward uh, do more innovations add more uh, technology and techniques and uh, uh, take this forward so this legacy when i retire i would like to see more and more youngsters take up endoscopy and uh, make this endoscopy as uh, in gi surgery today every technology every technique uh, every surgery is done by laparoscopy no more open surgeries in uh, gi surgeries today so same thing uh, i w- i wish that uh, tomorrow every spine surgery is done endoscopy way uh, that's what i want to see youngsters doing that in future so the legacy i want to leave behind is the 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 knowledge uh, where the youngsters can take it forward so like based on your experience what are like the best qualities a doctor should have yeah so whatever age advancements come whatever technology comes the quality of a, a doctor should not uh, change and it will never change so we uh, in sanskrit they say vaidyo narayano hari uh, it means that uh, a doctor the people believe that uh, is equal to god so what do you mean by that so when you are treating a patient he thinks that uh, you have come in the form of god to cure their illness so you should never forget that so you will be you are in a such a noble procedure pro, uh, profession a doctor should never forget uh, about the ethics about uh, the outcome about his duties responsibilities he should never forget when you are taken medicine as a as a profession definitely you have a lot of sacrifices lot of trauma but you should never ever uh, uh, forget the ethics and your uh, uh, whatever oath you take that you should never harm the patient and uh, giving best outcome is your ultimate goal so the quality of that uh, a person should never change even uh, 100 years back or today uh, the attitude of a, a doctor should be the same he should always think patient as the Uh, patient first should be always the motive